Hey folks, in this short video, I'm gonna show you a couple of ways that you can create a live audience when giving a speech in an online speech class. Let's go ahead and take a look. All right, so the first and perhaps the simplest option is just to go ahead and give your presentation face-to-face. -face. This could happen in any space that you have access to. A very popular one is just to go ahead and give this in your living room or den. In order to prove that you actually have a live audience, you'll need to make sure that they're visible in the frame. Some folks like to set up a camera behind the audience so that they're visible. Other folks will have a member of their audience set up and frame both the speaker and the audience in the shot. If you opt for the face-to-face -face method, you might find that it's really helpful to pick up one of these cheap little phone tripod holders. I think I found mine on Amazon for about 15 bucks, but they make a wide variety of these now. This makes it easier to find a space behind your audience to go ahead and set up your camera so that it's possible to film the presentation without having an audience member having to stand there and hold the phone the entire time. But if you don't have one, that is definitely a secondary option. And I've seen folks get really creative stacking up books and things to be able to make an impromptu tripod for their phone. All right, great. So this brings us to our second popular option for having a live audience in an online speech, which is using video conferencing software. Over the last couple of years, folks have gotten very familiar with video conferencing programs like Zoom, and they're a great way to bring a live audience into a speech. There are two required components to have this work in a video conference. First, everyone needs to have their cameras on so that it can simulate a live audience. But also, you need to make sure that you have your video conference software set to be in gallery view so you can see that Brady Bunch of everybody's faces on the recording. Well, that wraps up this discussion of a couple of ways that you can create a live audience while giving a speech online. I hope these tips were useful to you and good luck in your speech.